Hello everybody, I'm Dan's Gaming, and we're going to be doing a early look at the game called Control. This game comes out Tuesday, August 27th? Um, but we get to play it a little bit early. I can only play up until mission four, at, at, right up to mission four, so we can't get too deep into the game, but hopefully this gives us a nice little preview of the game. See if we are interested in getting it for ourselves. If you guys are like on the fence about it, this probably will be your like, hmm, I'm gonna get it or mm, I'm not kind of moment. So let's hope it's good. And we'll just jump right in and see what this game's all about. And yes, RTX is on, but I was getting really bad frame rates with the high RTX, so I turned that down to medium. Um, the patch for NVIDIA isn't out yet for this game, so that usually makes it usually makes it better. So I'll double check it tomorrow when they release the patch for the game if it's if it makes it run better. Usually they they make a huge difference the first day launch patch. All right. Here we go. Your warning. This is gonna be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that... I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like... We live in a room. And there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it, and we think that's the whole world. The room... ...and the poster. The picture's something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie... What is it called? The prison movie. Shawshank? The room's a cell, and the picture, it's... ...different. For each of us, it can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Who are you talking Hello? to? Anyone here? Who is she talking to? Security check. Remove underwear. No, outerwear. Empty pockets and remove metals. Place condoms in bins. There's no one here, though. here prohibited items reminder no authorized weapons no pagers pagers no laptops smart watches smartphones smart gaming devices anything smart well chat you're, you're allowed in then uh, number two pencils you have to consider iconic representations of archetypal concept rubber ducks ketchup bottles um, wipe ketchup bottles. 
archetypal concept. <laughs> the material under Bureau of Investigation is to be brought into the private entrances. Seeing a lot of personnel and breaches possibly the fight supervisor immediately. Why no ketchup bottles? Or rubber ducks. And more importantly, who's trying to bring a rubber duck into a federal building? This seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. Well, technically, you're a person that was created in this world, so you as a character would only know this symbol because the developers gave birth to you. And that's all you know. Staffing surveillance, officer equipment, general cost, mold removal, blah, blah, blah. cost breakdown. Sprint. Game magazine. Game about secret agents. Our bureau at work. <laughs> Why is it the back of that man? Director Zachy Zachariah Trench. Who bathroom? I guess I have to practice control by not going. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. Um, what is that? Pistachios, pretzels, crackers, fiber, protein. Trail mix. Are these unbranded? Hot and spicy? Unbranded chips? Ugh. I don't know if I want government made unbranded chips. That sounds disgusting. They're so sad looking. A shark in his, although secure, permission to following basic protocol shoot to kill. Good luck. Attention all. Everything's censored. More censored than Australian video games. Uh, Federal Bureau of Control. Hello. As you should all know by now, the R4 reports are due to, by the end of the week. We're still waiting then for a number of people. If you need an extension, please request R4.E from Supervisor. If you think you're exempt from filing an R4, you need to get written permission from your department chief saying so. Remember, R4s are mandatory under Section 75.2 of the Employee Manual. If your R4 requires interdepartmental claims, then please contact the appropriate department head. Uh, Dr. Darling, Mrs. Marshall, Mr. Salvatore, Mr. Kirkland, as needed. They'll be busy on Thursday in their annual policy review, so please schedule accordingly. To random government documents written very government bureau bureaucracy style. Hello? Hey, excuse me. Hello? There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti. Janitor, by the way. You'll work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, either you are no elevator. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you hollowed. I've done enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ahti the janitor is a friendly face in my book. 
better than somebody with no face at all. <laughs> Think about it. No face. But that said, I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. Did you just read my mind? Uh, that's a trap. Let's go past it first. This room looks just like the other one. This is definitely, this is definitely a different part of the building, but this, this it looks the same. No, it's, it, it is different. Wait a minute. Hold on. This is different. But it looks the same. Uh, how to handle unscheduled visitors entering the lobby. Start with the following. Welcome to the Federal Bureau of Control, established 1964 as part of the, eff the effort to strengthen government relations. We are proud uh, to serve the United States and her people as we strive for transparency and excellence in all aspects of our esteemed nation's infrastructure. If they do not leave, then ask them the questions. Are you here to see someone? Are you from the New York City or just visiting? How did you find the place? Answers are sufficiently harmless. Explain that this is a secure federal office and they'll need to leave. If their answers seem, escort them to the private room. They're, they're, they're perform the Gunnar's psychological exam. If their response is with an acceptable range of deviants, see the providing score sheet, then blank immediately. Remember, there's no such thing as too suspicious. Yeah, this room just, th this looks just like the entrance before, but that room wasn't there. And upstairs, right in this spot here, there was a picture of the janitor and not an elevator. And then if I go back this way, The, it's changed. The snack machine is here and there's no hallway anymore. Remember, we walked down the hallway to the snack machine. It's, it's the rooms are changing. It's not the same anymore. Like I've lost control. The cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? No. Did I lose you there for a moment? A little you bit. You know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. 17 years since the men of this bureau took him. Internal lockdown effect, building lockdown in effect.
Uh, reminder, drafting any public-facing material. When pending a notifications of death related to Willow AWE, please adhere to the following guidelines. Word phrase to use. In service of his country, regret, proud, pride will be remembered. Words to and phrases to avoid. Alaska, scissors, blood, bled, lost, apologies, sorry. Very, very weird place. Um. Why is everything all floating physics stuff? Barbara, I am not to be disturbed. Cancel all appointments for the day and for the rest of the week. I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one. Trench. <gasps> shit. Shit, shit, shit. Yep, they do that when they die. You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? Who are you talking about, too? That's the director. He killed himself. Results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner, and you, <laughs> you're it. Complete the board instruction to complete the astral plane challenge. What the hell? Have you gone, Polaroid? So weird. Service weapon generates ammo automatically when not in use. Gotta recharge. Oh man, so many particle effects. Uh, oh, there you are. They've got they've got weapons of their own now. Enemies drop health elements when damage collect health elements to restore health. Something's 
coming. This threat. An attack. Duty as director. Keep the Bureau safe. Did you hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me, and it was just noise, and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. Things have quieted down outside. Is oh. it safe to go? Okay. Oh, there's a map. Find do not have a clearance level. Service weapon. Objects oh. of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. A side note, remember to cover their connection to the astral plane as well. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. Lose and you're, well, fucked. Thank you. I'm Dr. Darling, Head of Research, Federal Bureau of Control. Okay. <laughs> this is so weird. It's just so bizarre, and I don't know what the hell's going on anymore. So strange. Yeah, the people that made Alan Wake made this game. And the lead direct, the creative lead of this game is the actor who played, um, who played, uh, Alan Wake. The hotline. Secure line of communication. Wait a minute, I'm the director now. Guide us. Reach the hotline. The hotline, says the dead man. Okay. What the hell is going on? Like they're not real guards. They're they're like a mat. I don't know what like reality is mixing with some other not reality, and it feels real. And it's just bizarre. Uh, drafting any public facing material while pending an invocation of death to the blade of the widow. Oh, wait, not this one. Effective immediate mints. Rising cost of AWE response. Um, 
update on mold extraction efforts, annual um, upcoming annual salary review, reminder for people to click the sub button to sell with Twitch Prime, new supplier of coffee filters to be found and vetted. Uh, please come prepared. Thank you for your time. I hear chanting. Oh, thank God, the bathroom. I can shoot toilet paper. No mirrors in the bathroom. Hmm. Oh, videotape. I mean, audio tape. Reminder. If you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. One, search the room for any altered items or objects of power. Of power. Two, carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. Three, wait for bureau staff to find you and the object. If there are no altered items or objects of power in the vicinity, then reach your supervisor via the nearest intercom and await further instructions. Thank you for your attention. Oh, so reality around me bends to its will and then I, I'm stuck in a terrible fine dimension. Just grab something, go to a safe room. They're floating in the air. And they're talking to each other. Weapon mod, ammo efficiency. Oh, there's weapon mods. Ammo cost per shot minus six percent. Yeah. Well, okay then. So you get upgrades for the weapon. AWE investigations for Marshall's eyes only. Marshall, we've checked out the suspected AWE in Duluth. Wasn't anything just like the house fire before this, and the malfunctioning clothes dryer before that. My team is getting pretty sick of duds. We need to, to find a better way to sort the fake AWEs from the real things, or we need to rotate these field agents off for a bit. Anyway, we're on route to Sherman Ranch, next one on the list. Let's hope it's a little livelier there. Sincerely, Special Agent Keenum. Let's uh, see what's in here. The hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. That bow. Urban legends. Urban legends are believed to affect the creation of altered materials, but can also dictate the characteristics of an altered world event. Urban legends are understood as the modern evolution of Jung's archetypes. We need, need, recognize certain blank informed by our own and popularized by our media. We have additionally proven that urban legends can be artificially blank in popular cultures. Blank our bureau made anthology television program. Once the seeds are sown, human imagination exacerbates the details. Certain paranormal, paranatural phenomena contain clear elements of popularized folklore. Davies can only occur on blank. A pair of scissors that consume human blank through two punctures on the blank. These details living in the minds of many have given strength to belief. Urban legends are not just the stories of children. They are paranatural realities waiting to happen. It's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. 